potatoes going potato, taters going tate, and haters going hate. Today we're traveling to Europe. So we're currently right now in the Portland airport, PDX. We went through all the security and everything. It was a lot, so that's why I didn't record anything until now. But now we're waiting to get to into our gate, B10. And our first stop is San Francisco. And then I'll let you guys know each of our stops next when we land at each of them. We're taking four planes and it'll be a total of 26 hours travel time. So stay tuned with us. We got up at 5 a.m. and our first flight is at 7.25. One hour, 19 minutes to San Francisco. We're in San Francisco. So in order to get to our next flight, we have four hours, but we have to take the air train basically. So we exited the airport and then we have to take the air train all the way to our gate because it's a separate international gate and terminal from this terminal. I always forget how big San Francisco airport is, but our flight was pretty good. The first half was very bumpy, very bumpy, very turbulent, which usually doesn't bother me, but with small airplanes, it bothers me because I get more air sick, but I was able to fall asleep and actually because I fell asleep, slept through the landing, so that was nice. So we have an issue with our tickets where because we switched airline, our first flight was from Portland to San Francisco with Alaska Airlines. Now we're flying San Francisco to Istanbul, Turkey with Turkish Airlines. It won't show up in the system that we already flew, so it's not marked in the system that we've already flown our Alaska flight, so they have to go in manually to make it pop up that we have flown. And then we'll be able to get checked in with our Turkish airline and show that our bags are also going to fly all the way directly to our final destination. So we're just waiting now. Finally made it to security. They had one more issue. I think we ended up waiting like 40 minutes, but we're through now. We got a tempe sandwich, a fermented soybean sandwich, a coffee, and chips. Our flight is delayed like half an hour more, but um, because the aircraft that we're going to be using came late, so we're just waiting. Got a nice view of the tarmac. have headphones, they look like this, They give you three masks. Three. Good 
the windows can change with shades. So they're electronic, so you can change it from no shade to a little bit of shade. That makes it a little dimmer, or you can change it to almost like a nighttime shade. You press it, these buttons that go up and down so you can dim it or not. Each passenger had a menu in the seat pocket in front of them that we can choose which meal we want to eat when they came around with the cart. The food was looking really tasty and honestly we were very excited to try this food. They came around and gave each, each passenger a baggie. There were three different types of baggies and apparently the patterns are related to cultural patterns seen in Turkish culture. Inside of each baggie, they were color coordinated depending to the theme of the bag. And we got slippers, I'm assuming to use on the plane to get in the bathroom. They also gave us earplugs. and a toothbrush and toothpaste. They also gave us vegan lip balm, which was green tea flavored. An eye mask to wear for when we sleep. And socks, and they're also grippy socks, I'm assuming so that way your slippers can actually stay on your feet. They're long socks too so they keep you warm. And the bag is pretty spacious, I was surprised that that much fit in there. Cosmina's baggie had a really nice dark blue color, like kind of like a royal blue, very pretty. I got the rigatoni with alfredo sauce that also had sautéed spinach and mushrooms and parmesan cheese. It came with an extra virgin olive oil lemon sauce for the salad and some butter to put on there and also eggplant salad and shepherd salad and a little dessert. Cosmina had gotten the grilled filet of codfish. They have eggplant salad. It smells so good. I think, and it has this, which is lotion, this is soap, this is like scent sticks to smell good, that perfume, like cologne. It's very nice. I mean, my fingers. And another mirror. I like the bathroom a lot. There's even a bidet! I'm not gonna use that though. Also, whenever you want, you can order a cheese sandwich that had cheese, peppers, and cucumbers in it with some kind of spread and a chocolate muffin. Thank you.
Right before landing, they gave us some kind of sauce for a salad, as well as pancakes with apple compote and raspberry coulis, a fruit salad, some cheese, butter and jam for our bread. The cheese was feta cheese and I think a brie with cucumber and tomato slice. So we made it to Istanbul. It was a 12 hour flight. Clearly you can tell how that flight went. It was fine, but so three seats on the left, three seats in the middle, three seats on the right. And I was on the rightmost seat in the middle. And there were a woman right across the aisle from me filling up the three seats and the row in front of them filling up two seats who were so loud the whole time talking so loud, yelling practically, laughing. They were even climbing up on the seats on their feet to like walk across the seats or to get up into the overhead compartment. It was so annoying. You could not sleep well, but no one told them to be quiet. I wanted to tell them, but I don't know why I didn't. Anyways, the food was really good. I know that you guys saw the food, the food was good. I couldn't eat any of the fruits for breakfast because I'm allergic and we only have an hour here until we have to fly out to Bucharest or Bucharest in Romania. Keep following along. It's right now 12.30. So, and then our next flight leaves in 40 minutes. So we had some trouble with our luggage. We didn't get pushed through again. Um, so we had to wait and we were so, so one of the last people before it because of that. But they figured it out. So don't fly with three different airlines. It's a lot of work. So this airplane seemed like a really old airplane, but it has this remote, which I think is really cool and I haven't seen in any other airplane before, where it works like a remote for like watching things, channels, volume, but then on the other side it has like a game controller basically, and also a keyboard, and you play games with it, it's pretty cool. So we were still flying with Turkish Airlines from Bucharest to Istanbul, so we had similar food. We had the same kind of salad with mozzarella and tomatoes, the same kind of dressing for the salad, the same kind of dessert, and the same kind of sandwich that we had before.
don't see what it's like in the Romanian airport. It smells like cigarettes and cologne. So we made it to the apartment that we're going to be staying at in the city, in Timisoara. Four flights. 26 hours of travel, but it was it was good. Um, so stay tuned to see the rest of our travels.